my videos uh, from about a year ago, you'll know that I was training a dog named Maya, and um, unfortunately she was stolen out of my car, so um, I lost her. Um, I'd only had her for a couple of weeks, and I hadn't had her chipped yet, and I wasn't able to find her. Um, so after that, and having had to watch Karen a few months before that, um, I just wasn't ready to move on and try again yet. I needed some time. A couple of months ago, uh, I had an incident where I fell off of a four foot high porch late at night and I injured my tailbone and I couldn't get up. I was stuck on my back and couldn't move. And because it was so late at night, nobody was around, nobody could hear me hollering for help. I laid there for a good long while before anybody finally found me and it really scared me. So I decided that it was time that I try again. And so I looked for a while and finally came across Merlin here, whose name was originally Rumble, which is very fitting because when he runs from one end of the house, he rumbles the entire house. <laughs> But I like the name Merlin, and so that's what I named him. And he is an 11-month-old German Shepherd dog, and he's registered and has his papers and all that. Of course, I don't have the papers right now because they still haven't got here in the mail, but I don't really care about that. Um, he is... Merlin, come here. Look, come here. Come on here. Show everybody your pretty face. Show everybody your pretty face. Yes, yes, yes. Pretty boy. Um, he is what they call a um, liver colored German Shepherd. So everywhere that he would normally be black, including his little nose, he's brown. Yeah, he's brown. So he's a little bit crazy right now because he's in that teenage puppy stage and he just doesn't realize how big he is. No, he doesn't. He doesn't realize how big he is. He's very mouthy still. He likes to try to bite. Not like aggressively, but play biting. And I'm working on trying to train him out of that. But he's doing a really good job. I haven't had him for, eh, it's been like a week and a half now. Most of my videos that I'm going to be putting up in the next few days are from like the first week I had him. I just, I haven't been feeling well, so I haven't done any working on them or whatever. Um, I don't like to edit my videos very much because I like to show people what it's really like to train a dog. If you've never done it before, you watch the videos on YouTube that are wonderful videos. I'm not um, harping on them in any way, but at least the ones that I've found it kind of seems to me like these are dogs that have already been pretty well trained so they already know what to do and they just behave like that perfectly. That's not the case with a dog that's not been trained, at least not that I've found, <laughs> especially a younger dog. Um, he doesn't always listen. It takes a lot of time to get to where he will listen and stop trying to fight with the kitty. Merlin, leave it. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. Come lay down. Come here. Leave the kitty alone. Uh -uh. Leave the kitty alone. Come here. Get your bone. Come get your bone. Lay down. Come get your bone. Lay down. Come here. Lay down. Play with your bone. Come here. Come over here. Over here. You want to go to that side? You want to go to that side? What? Huh? What am I talking about? Come here. Come here. Hey. Look. Merlin. See, just like that, he didn't listen at all. Merlin, come here. Lay down. Come here. Merlin, come. Come here. Come here. Lay. Lay. Come here. Down. Give me that bone. Come here. Give me your bone. Give me your bone. Let go. Let go. Ah, ah, ah. We're not playing right now. Let go. Come here. Down. Down, Merlin, down, 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 ah, ah, 
Nope. No, sir. Come here. Come here. Down. Down. Ah, ah, ah. Merlin. Ah. Down. You want this? Down. You are not playing. Lay down. Merlin. Look. Good. Good boy. Down. Down. Come on. Down. Merlin. Down. Uh -uh. Down. No. Down. Down. Sit. Hey. Sit. Down. Merlin. Down. Down. Good boy. There you go. I, I didn't tell you you could get up. Okay. We're clearly having trouble with his actual staying in positions that he's put into, but it takes time and patience and work. Um, anyways, what I was saying, um, those, those tutorials are so very helpful and that's how I've learned how to train my dog and I'm still learning. I still watch videos all the time, but, um, they make it look so, so simple and like your dog's always going to obey you all the time, every time. Most of them, anyway. Um, but I don't want people to think it's that easy and, and have misinformation just from, because it's easier to film a short video and with a dog that's already trained that knows what to do versus what it's really like to work with a dog that doesn't know what to do and has to take time to learn it. And especially with a younger dog, they don't always listen they're rambunctious they get distracted like so easy um i just kind of want to show all of the trials and everything that you go through with with all of that in training so i don't like to edit a lot of my stuff out um i will if it's something that he's just really having trouble with and it takes up too much of the video and we're just we'll just leave it out and try it again some other time when he's more focused um but, you know, for the most part, I just kind of want to show the, the whole process from start to finish with, with training him. And, um, you know, when you're working on training your dog, whether it's for service work or just basic obedient tra training, whatever, or tricks or whatever you want to do, um, the same methods all work. Um, but just you just got to be uh, upbeat, playful, happy, um, you know. You can't get mad or frustrated or, or anything like that because the, the dog can sense that. And he it'll just confuse them and, and stress them out and they won't work as well and they won't learn as well. So if you find yourself getting stressed out or angry or whatever, it's time to stop. Just tell your dog, free dog, and, and then, you, you know, y'all go play together or something. Um, Go do something fun. Go go to the park. Go to the lake. Whatever. Whatever you and your dog like to do. Just, it, you know, you start getting stressed out and angry or whatever. It's time to go and just make it fun and play time. That's the best advice I can give. I hope you enjoy watching Merlin learn. 